Tai Chi for today. We had first punk. Let the sparrow fly. The double punk last week's sub form and today the inner hand is coming over the outer then parallel taking the weight to the right leg now let the arms coming down a little loosen up and then to the front with your hip and your weight and up with the hands the application don't think too much about it but it's good to know the application for the Beijing form uh, because you can um, can remember the form and you are um, more familiar with the meaning of it you know that your body is still to the front because there is your enemy in real combat situations you know we are not dealing with martial arts you know this 24 form is developed for health benefit and that's what we are performing but it's good to know what might be the application the lower arm or the shoulder is coming you know here in your hands from an opponent and this opponent will push you know, so you're taking this force letting your arms come down by yourself you know where your opponent is going and if this opponent is still pushing just lose a little bit that he or she will become unstable and then just distributing your weight to the front and that should do it no that's so that's the whole application so that that you know what your hands are doing you know and of course you can forget it and play around with it improvise you know so that you are uh, getting more used to your bodily feelings and that your arms might come down you know play around with it Th this might be a way if the opponent is going down 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 lead him to the side like the let the sparrows f fly you know and you can feel the natural way of your body body while playing around improvise you know that's good but come back for the 24 form to this loose forward and there's a little twist you know because your hip is rotating your upper body is still directed to the front and then to the front And of course, use this snapshots as yoga asanas, as always in my teaching. You know, that you are relaxing, relaxing in this form and develop your inner smile so that you are always smiling and relaxing while performing. really that that if you need a goal that's the goal you know not a perfect form you know 
that's not the goal. The goal is know about your body, about your mind, develop your inner smile, you know? And of course, deal with your outer circumstances in life as you are able to. Develop a comfortable way of living. Not, not running for money. We all need money. It's obvious. But money is not the goal. Even the way to earn money should be with your smile. And that's a really tough one for the most of us. Because the most of us not not living the highest ideals of your youth. So where are you in your life, where, wherever you are in your life, you know, deal with this. And building your life slowly into a comfortable living condition. You know? Not in, there are no, no bang effects, you know, slow, tiny, tiny steps towards this inner smile, an easy flowing life. And we are not in the pursuit of happiness. We are in the cultivation of contentment. That's a little bit different. It's also part of this Zen Qigong. No, you might get it. It's more to it. Other side, because these are mirrored. Next week is the U-turn. I thought this week, but... One pun. Let the sparrow fly. Double pun. And then, for this week, Two sparrows coming to you, <laughs> pushing, loose a little bit and very, very smooth, putting the sparrows back. Sparrows coming to you, a little down, loose and forward. And now I'm trying to keep my upper body to the front. you're rotating and feeling your own bodily weight, body weight. One more time. That's it. That's enough Tai Chi for today. Okay. 